Michigan. We're here. So we made it to Charlevoix. We're already uh, taking care of our Airbnb. <laughs> sure. Maggie's standing. She's about to hop in the bath. It's like wild blackberries. I'm 99% sure these are blackberries. Maybe they're poison berries. I don't know. How can you tell the difference? No, I don't have that special app. Sorry, I look tired because I am. This is right outside of our... Might be our, my pizza guy. For it. I think that's my pizza guy. Never had a pickle pizza before, but today's the day. Also ordered a taco pizza. This is called the Cheesy Bird. Just in case they didn't like that, I got just a simple cheese pizza with stuffed cheese crust. That one? Got it. We would try it together. We're in Charlotte, Michigan. This is from BC Handmade for Me. Love dill pickle and I love pizza. So I feel like the two are like a slam dunk. It actually really works well. I love all the fresh dill. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Grayson's on his third piece of pizza. He loves this place. So this is our cute little Airbnb. We are here for quite a few days. I'm just happy to be here. I'm really tired. I'm hoping tomorrow I'm gonna... I'm hoping tomorrow I bounce back. He's not used to these neighborhoods not having fences. So he thought that swing set, he could just run up and swing on it. But I don't know the neighbors. It's like, you need to stay off the swings. But the hammock is the next best thing. While these beauties are sleeping, or Grayson's kind of sleeping, I'm going to have some me time. Every morning I did meditation in their mud room and it was glorious. The sun came up, it was beautiful. If y'all ever want me to share meditations, I'd love to, just let me know in the comments. When I came back to my phone, I discovered all these new portraits. <laughs> what do you think? The kids were building while we were making breakfast before we left for our very first day at the beach, AKA the lake. This is probably my favorite park. The water is crystal clear. You will want sandals because there's so many rocks, but you can find Petoskey stones. You can find Charlevoix stones. It is one of the most beautiful little spots. That's our crew right there. Grayson's trying to bury himself in the sand. And he's making sand castles. Oh, that was horrible. Let me try again. Oh, that was even worse. Okay, maybe not. She needs to warm up. I need to warm up. From the beach, you just climb up this little hill, keep climbing. You can actually camp here as well, which I wanna do sometime. Keep climbing, always climb, and then you're there. And I'm out of breath from that tiny little hill. And there's the beach. This place is amazing. We're currently downtown Charlevoix. In Charlevoix, you can visit both Lake Michigan and Lake Charlevoix, which are both two very different but beautiful lakes. Downtown is amazing. It's all mama papa shops and there's a real sense of community within their downtown. They even had a Walmart that tried to move into the county and they all petitioned together to keep it out and they succeeded. Look at this beautiful lake. Gorgeous. 
The amphitheater that is connected to this park is named after my grandfather, the Odemark Pavilion. I'll show you a lot more of this beauty tomorrow. There she is. She's a beaut, Clark. Imagine watching a show and that is your view. Gorgeous. Here we have the Veterans Park where 11 trees were put in for World War I veterans that had passed. Those trees are now huge and abundant. Culver's is a fairly new addition to Charlevoix. So what is this like? It says Deca Park. Here goes what? Do you like the lake? Yes or no? All right, y'all, stay tuned for the rest of our family joining us in Charlevoix, Michigan, and way more fun.